a crusher it's uh, Matteo from GMB Crush here and welcome to this new video training all about the GMB Crush custom GPT. We have built a custom GPT that uh, lets you analyze your uh, GMB Crush reports in real time and in this training I will show you exactly how to break down uh, the prompts using the GMB Crush optimization protocol. So what are we going to cover exactly in this video training? I will uh, walk you through how to analyze uh, GMB Crush reports uh, using a set of prompts uh, that uh, will pull high value insights from your GMB Crush data. These insights uh, can be then used uh, to build optimization strategies, create uh, reports for clients, and even automate parts of your audit and data extraction process, saving you time and effort. Our GMB Crush Custom GPT is uh, directly connected to the GMB Crush API, meaning all the analysis is done through OpenAI leveraging the power of AI-driven insights. Now let's dive in and see just how powerful this uh, custom GPT is, and more importantly, how it can help you. Okay, in this video, we will see how to analyze uh, an existing uh, GMB Crash GeoGrid report. So what you need to do, you simply need to click on Analyze an existing report, uh, and uh, once you click, as you can see, the GPT will ask uh, for uh, your uh, GMB Crush paid account, username and password. You will simply need to enter all the details and uh, you will uh, log it in. So at this point, as you can see, the custom PT is asking you if uh, you would like to analyze uh, a GeoGrid report or an extension X report uh, and I have selected to analyze an existing GeoGrid report. So after that, the custom GPT will show you a number of reports that are linked to the Micrash account. So it can go through all the GeoGrid reports that you already create within your GMB Crush account. And now we are going to see how to analyze those reports properly. I have uh, selected a GeoGrid report uh, for uh, the keyword uh, Boston Movers. And as you can see, there are uh, different variations of the main keywords here. Okay. So what I have done, I have uh, done uh, several GeoGrid reports in the past to analyze the top competitors in the GMB Crush GeoGrid Pro report for all of these different keywords. Now I will uh, select one keyword and show you how to use uh, the first prompt. In the first prompt, we will see how to identify specific underperforming location inside uh, the GeoGrid report where main business linked to the GeoGrid audit report is not in position one, position number two, or for example, in position three. We will go step by step to find uh, these underperforming locations and spot the potential optimization areas and check other useful details that we can extract using the first prompt and the rest of the GeoGrid analysis prompts. So in the first prompt, we are going to identify, as I said before, all the locations where the business is not ranking in the, in the top spots while excluding competitors from the analysis. So as you can see here, we now have a full list of locations where uh, the business is not in position number one, two, or three. And uh, we can now get uh, additional key insights uh, from uh, these locations and service areas where uh, the business is underperforming. This uh, helps us uh, to build an initial set of recommendations and uh, collect baseline data that we will uh, refine and expand in the next prompt. Always uh, keep in mind that uh, the first batch of insights may be, will be a little bit uh, more general, but uh, as we continue adding prompts uh, during uh, the chat sessions, the, uh, to the comments, the data and the context that we provide. So as we move forward with the audit session, the data will be coming more accurate, of course, the strategy will be more precise and the recommendations will align even better with your optimization goals. 